Hello and welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel if you're new here. If you like what you see, don't forget to like and subscribe. It helps the YouTube algorithm know that the content is useful and promotes it to others. If you don't like it, let me know about it in the comments. If you still don't have a Star Citizen account, use my referral link in the description below or the code on screen to snag yourself some extra starting credits. Now on with the video. If you purchase a pledge for something, but then later decide you want a different one, or you just don't want that item anymore, you can in most cases exchange it for store credit, commonly referred to as melting it. Any pledge that you make can be recovered for store credit to use towards a replacement pledge. One notable exception is giveaway ships. As they have a $0 base value, they cannot be exchanged back to store credit. To exchange the pledge, you need to navigate your browser to the RSI website and open the My Hanger page. From there, find the pledge that you want to exchange. Click the arrow on the right side of the pledge card so it expands down. Then click the Exchange button. You'll be prompted by a window detailing what pledge you are removing, how much credit value you will receive, and some general warning disclaimers. If you wish to proceed, then check the boxes for the disclaimer warnings and then input your account password. Finally, click the Submit button. You will then receive the credit on your account and the pledge will no longer be listed in your hangar. After reclaiming the store credit for a pledge, you can then pick something else from the store and during the checkout process, you can choose to use the store credit on that purchase. It is not automatic, so you must manually apply the store credit to the purchase. Note that some things prohibit the use of store credit, such as war bond pledges, which require new money, or using the buyback system without an appropriate store credit token. Those tokens are distributed one per account per calendar quarter and they do not roll over. Cross chassis upgrades, or just CCUs, are a special type of pledge that you apply to an existing pledge in your hangar, allowing you to upgrade one vehicle to another. This requires that the vehicle you are upgrading from has a lesser store value than the one you are upgrading to. To get a CCU, you can do this from either the My Hangar page or any page on the pledge store. Look for the Ship Upgrades link and click it. This will take you to the upgrade page. On the left side, you can select the source chassis. To choose one of the vehicles that is currently in your hangar as a source upgrade chassis, just ensure that the option My Ships is selected. Then choose the ship. Then on the right side, you can select a target vehicle for the upgrade. It will display the difference in upgrade pledge cost, and you can add it to your cart. Once you have added it to your cart, you can proceed through the checkout. You can then also use store credits in most cases, except for war bonds. Once the checkout is complete, you will need to head to your hangar and apply the upgrade. Locate the CCU pledge and click the arrow on the right side of the pledge card to expand it. Click the Apply Upgrade button. Wait for it to load the source vehicles that are in your hangar. Click on the vehicle to upgrade and then click Next. If everything looks good, enter your account password and then click Apply. The hangar page will then refresh and the pledge you applied the upgrade to will now reflect that change. What is a buyback? The buyback system allows you to recover a pledge that you previously exchanged for store credit, even if it is no longer available in the store. If it is still available in the store, you're generally better off just repurchasing the pledge there. If it isn't, then you can use the buyback system. There are some restrictions, however. You only get one opportunity per calendar quarter to use store credit to recover the pledge, and the cost of the buyback may not be the same price as the original pledge price if it has changed since you first acquired the pledge. It is worth mentioning at this point that a buyback will be for the base pledge only. Any upgrades that you applied to the pledge prior to exchanging it for store credit are not reapplied. To buy back a pledge, navigate to the buyback pledge page. This is most easily found by going to your hangar page. Then on the left side navigation list, you'll see the buyback pledges link. On that page, there will list any pledges that you may buy back. Locate the one you wish to reacquire click the buyback button. This will take you to a special description page where it shows you what you're about to buy back. If this looks right, what you want to get, then click the add to cart button. Then proceed with the checkout. If you have the option and wish to use them, don't forget to apply store credits at this point. 